I'm about to turn these table ideas into beautiful 3D renders. So I posted this in my Discord and within the next 24 hours, my server got flooded with the most ridiculous ideas ever. So I booted up my PC and fired up Blender. At number 8 is Robert Pattinson as Jack Sparrow. Sounds like a recipe for a disaster. So after stealing, <coughs> I mean downloading 3D models of Captain Jack Sparrow and Pattinson's head, I started a new project in Blender and swapped their heads in edit mode. Jack Sparrow from Ohio be like. Then I decided to take my render to a next level by modeling some low poly sand, water and rocks, added basic materials, lights and BOOM! The final render looks like it was straight out of Pirates of the Caribbean movie. On number 7 is Discord Mod Touches Grass. Discord mods are one dimensional fat characters so I found one on Sketchweb and oh my well, then I modeled some grass using a hair particle system on a plane. Now we need to make him touch grass. You know what? Screw up touching. I'm gonna make him lie flat on the grass. I mean, why not, right? And to top it all off, I added a vest in his left hand for an extra bit of humor. Then I created skin <laughs> materials and rendered out this sweaty image. Looks like we caught up after filming a video. At number 6 is paper play button for 1k subs. In case you missed it, I've already made a paper play button and it's a work of art. Read the 5th submission, a black and white cat wearing socks standing on an Excalibur stone. So I found this cat online, texture painted it black and white and modern an Excalibur stone from scratch. Added bunch of debris, trees and volumetric fog to give it a sense of depth. Then I hand the cat on an Excalibur and <laughs> made this questionable sock. Yeah, I won't use any socks. Then I started rendering it on my RDX. Intel Core i3 3rd generation PC. Look, a variant of Kitty attempting to steal the Excalibur. At number 4 is John Wick holding Superman in his right hand and Batman in his left what? hand on a bike that is riding on a mountain top. Bro, what are you talking about, man? So, I found a bizarre looking Keanu Reeves along with Superman, Batman, and a motorbike. Then I rigged John Wick and positioned him like he's holding both Superman and Batman on a motorcycle. Do not question my rigging or I'll come to your house and delete all of your project files. I modeled Mountain using a displacement modifier, added neon lights, and made a quote unquote Aurora for the sky. The final result is a crazy piece of art. So we're in the top 3 and things are about to get heated up. Make the most overpowered Iron Musk Activa 2023. This one is kinda cool yet unbelievable at the same time. So I found Elon Musk's chopped head on the internet, an Iron Man suit and a futuristic bike. I started a new project and removed Iron Man's helmet and his legs. I replaced it with Elon Musk's head and a leg with a tire. Then I added an icosphere and applied a wireframe modifier to give it a futuristic look. I made metallic materials, futuristic neon lights, and rendered out the image. And this is how Elon Musk will look like if Neuralink is a success. At number 2 is two armed zombie that without legs that can crawl only. So this one sounds a bit too disgusting. I started a new project in Blender and found this beautiful looking human being on the internet. Please don't kill me! I'm not married! My life is awesome! I got rid of his legs in edit mode. Then I got a message from Usman saying that if the end results are great, he'll void from me. Oh my god! Yeah, the stakes are pretty high now. So I started sculpting his body and face into a disgusting looking zombie for the next three hours. Now for the skin, I had to procedurally make a really simple node tree setup. But there's no depth to the mesh. So I used the one and only, the best of all, a bump toad. Dang. <laughs> It took realism to a whole another level. Then I rendered out the image, sent it to Usman, and this was his initial reaction. Okay, it looks good. <laughs> Wait till you see the second render. Yo, that is actually terrifying. And he paid me $5 for the result. If you want to support this channel, please help me out on my Fiverr account so I can make more of these fun type Blender videos. But now, we are at number 1. An AI robot walking a human child like a pet dog on a leash in the future. So, I think this is the worst one yet. I found a Terminator 3D model, a rigged boy, and a free 3D model of a town. I imported them into Blender and oh, my PC just crashed as soon as I started a new project in Blender. Wow. Terminator is standing on a skull. Classic. I made metallic materials, warm and cold light to represent post-apocalyptic war and positioned that boy like a pet dog. <coughs> then I modeled a leash using a bezier curve. I set up my camera angle and rendered out the image. This might be the worst thing that could ever happen to us in the future. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Hit the like button and support me on my Fiverr account. I'll see you in the next video. Peace out.